Hello and welcome to part 4 of our Kingdoms gameplay. Um, we are going to continue looking for a settler with a trading skill. I hope we'll find one soon. But if we don't, we are going to... Probably... Oh. That's... That was an interesting like spike. So yeah. Um, we just go to the village and start building stuff. Maybe that will attract other people around. Or maybe we should help this guy of Brugai. Oh yeah, he has finally um, unglitched himself since um, in the last part I helped him build this house, but he was glitched inside this building. Right. My name is Wardnoop, nice to meet you. We're going to eat a nice approach still. Ferrari, could you teach me? Please be a trader. Please be a trader. Ah. Oh. Scholar. I can teach you to write. What would that help us? Or how? A well. Notice board, common house, city hall. But isn't... Oh, right, common house is probably... Probably... The one which can hold... Several, several settlers. I suppose. Um, no clue really. But that seems like an interesting skill, at least. Yeah, I, I don't know. Ah, okay, yeah, it's this one. Yeah. All right, yeah. Now it makes sense. Yeah. It's going to be a useful skill if we're going to start a settlement of our own, but I'm still hoping for the trading. Trading perk to to be found. That's the first priority. Now I just hope that I can find the village, the bigger village. Ooh. Um, I think it was this way. I think it was south from here. Since this was the second um, village or settlement, I don't know, farm that I encountered. And I think I had to go north from the first village. Um, yeah, this makes it a bit trickier. Um, I mean... Uh, it makes it trickier when you don't have a map, since you can't find anything around here. Unless you memorize all the places or like draw a map for yourself, but... Yeah. It's a bit annoying if, if you are someone with... with as bad memory as myself when it comes to remembering certain places or spots spots in a game well at least we know that um, the sea is on the eastern side of the island 
now it seems or appears that we are heading towards a ruin I'm pretty sure of it yeah but what do we have here I think it's another ruin oh there's the ship but well let's find out maybe we'll get lucky oh oh I see a building that's really promising yeah they have started building around the ship that's awesome that is very good this this is nice okay so we have two question marks the other one is probably just ruins but this this one is worth investigating maybe I'll help this this place to flourish and help them build build more buildings and but put them up for um, common use or for sale or well oh oh it's a fox we need the meat making the skinning skill so hard to obtain really really might not be a great idea it, it would be nice to it would be nice to actually to actually um, be able to skin animals it's such a crucial part of the game uh, after all okay that was just an ordinary untreated stone I still don't know how to add the tools and weapons to quick um, quick bar all were to to get to oh crap okay there's a fight going on oh it's a bandit's lair this could be bad I'm glad I saved Ooh, wow <laughs> so the bandits have set up a lair just by the ship and I suppose we would have to fight them ha oh Oh crap, but I think he was going to kill me and he still is, he still is. Leodium, maybe there's another village behind this. Oh no, 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 that's not, that's not it, that is the bandit's lair. Okay, some distance. don't want to be hit can you teach me butcher okay okay he's still nice wow <laughs> oh wow wow knight steel pants knight steel armor that's awesome Wow. Oh, and, and gold. I almost didn't notice that. Well, mm, <laughs> it was not striking to him. But <laughs> uh, this is awesome. Uh, this made the game so much easier. I didn't know that this was a possibility. Oh, too bad I didn't get his weapon. That would have been awesome. But yeah, okay. This this really made made my gaming session so much more interesting. Okay, I really don't have any healing items, so we'll have to go and see. Go and see if there are any other bandits. I have a better armor now, so I can probably handle one bandit, but 
let's just um, assume that there isn't anyone else yet. That, that was nice, um, the global re reputation thing, actually. Okay, we, <laughs> um, we have gained control of the bandit slayer. Um, let's sleep till the sun's up. Nice. I don't like the night time, although we could um, we could use the torches, but um, yeah. Okay, the ships are right there now. New settlement was established. Wow, yeah. That's always awesome. Oh, wow, wow, another... I don't know. Oh, that's a farm, but... Well, in any case, settlement farm. Anything goes. Where's the owner? Over there. Oh, is that the owner? Since this is the second building here. Stugger. I'll help him build. But apparently I can't. It's not letting me. But I was able to build... Um, Uldir or whatever his name was. His house. Uh, I do have wood. Plenty of it, actually. Wow, that that's an awesome armor. And the whole global reputation thing. I'm, I'm still in awe. Eve, awe. How, you, how do you say it? <laughs> Pronounce it. But yeah, uh, that that was awesome. I'm now I'm actually excited. There's some content in this game. We just have to wait until we get more of bandits and stuff. Oh, and I'm also glad that you actually get armors as drop from from people, so you wouldn't have to craft everything. Mm, but well. In that case, it might have been wise to learn something else besides the trader, also. Oh no, I, no, no, no. Yeah, the trader is still the priority number one, since you still, still can get the gold which you need. Since um, there really aren't any bandits at the moment here, well, not too many bandits. Besides that one bandit um, who had 200 gold, which is more than than what I got from like 10, 10 times or 10 times in ruins since they have the chests. Yeah, that was something. All right, now we have healed up somewhat. Yeah, now we just need a better weapon and we're going to be um, doing, doing great. I still want to learn more blacksmithing, of course, because because um, the weapons are so customizable and well who knows um, how long is it going to take to get a better sword a steel sword or something of of the like it might take a while okay but we're doing it just fine with this okay we have our health to the full Okay, the question marks are unvisited places and maybe not even just ruins, but they can be villages, settlements. Well, that's odd. Um, what if I load? Or... No, I'm going to try and go to main menu and see if I can help this guy with building. Now, okay, no, this 
started building again. But I still can't help him with this. Okay, well, I'm glad that this game really took off. Um, after a bit of, of like stall time where there was not much to do, but now it's getting really interesting with all the new people people and content that comes with them. Oh, we have to take him down. He's wounded. Oh, he ran through a rock. That's one tough rabbit. Hmm. <laughs> it's like my character is swinging in the wrong di direction on purpose. <laughs> oh no, 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 what? Why would you do this? Take all. Oh. I don't want to give my girl to the rabbit. Why would even it even want to give me the possibility to do that? Uh, the bandit slayer doesn't look too shabby, but it's a cool, it's a cool thing to have. In the game. Oh, what's that? Ooh, wow. There, there's something going on. <laughs> something. Oh, that's a bear. But it's alright. We could actually probably challenge a bear and maybe even win with this armor. Okay, there we have a ruin. We have already visited it. A wolf. Mm. We're going to kill him. Shouldn't be too hard with this gear. Yeah. So much easier. Okay. But. Well. That's some loud thundering. Ooh! That's a raccoon! <laughs> that's sort of cute. I don't want to kill him. Wow. Awesome. <laughs> There's something wrong with his running animation though. I don't know, when I watch from him from behind there's something odd going on there, but... If I look at him from the side it just seems normal. Oh, there's another one! How come I haven't seen any of them? Ooh! There's something. We're going to want to investigate this. I'm hoping that would, wouldn't be a ruin, but a settlement. For the obvious reasons. Um, I really should get a bull and a horse when possible, since um, it's quite annoying to be hit and have to collect a lot of plants. Well, the other option is to get a um, herbalism skill, I think it was, or medicine. Well, yeah, whatever. Um, the one with, uh, which allows you to make the medicine. I have talked about this before. Alright. Let's just head over there. And yeah, 
that skill tree also has has the quicker picking picking thing for this plant so that's also also a good thing since they are so crucial that's Brugai but we're heading for the other place okay it's over there mm. not that far away wow I think it might be terrain that's killing killing my PC. Along with these plants and trees. Nah, I think this is going to be just a ruin. Oh no, no no, it's a village. Awesome. Or farm, yeah. Volodymyrium. I wonder if these are randomly generated uh, names, names for places. I could imagine. Or well, probably no, not randomly generated. Uh, probably just probably a list of names which these could be named. But I wonder. Oh. This the settlement finally, yeah. I think it's going to have. Mm, where, where do we have a fight? Oh, okay, it the bear just came too close to me. Yeah, awesome. We finally found the the actual big settlement where my house is also. There we can see the lights already. I don't know where the farm's owner was. Mm, might have been killed by the bear. But well. Oh wow. This really has has been growing. I think there's going to be some tasks for us. Yeah, um, yesterday's gameplay wasn't that interesting since we just uh, were... We're investigating the ruins and looking for some villages, but um, yeah, today is completely different. She has really nice armor. We better ni be nice to her. Bumbur! Sergeant. Hmm. Yeah, that's also going to be an important skill. I haven't actually. Ha Ooh! What are you doing? <laughs> Help! Help! <laughs> yeah, okay. That was autistic. Um, yeah. I still haven't even once gotten myself the sergeant skill and and built a warband. Okay, here we have another villager. It would be nice to see the your, your own house on the on the compass um, taskmaster all right he's just a builder so yeah it appears that we can loot the bodies of these settlers and bandits and all the people we kill or happen to kill Good to know. Too bad we can't craft any leather. But we're going to craft a better bow at some point. Not enough resources to craft. Oh, I see. We need steel ingots. And steel ingots can only be acquired through the novice blacksmith perk. But we can always make... Our, oh, okay. I'm an idiot. Oh. So, first you make iron ingots. 
makes complete sense, but I'm an idiot. Knight steel helmet, I see. For that we would need iron ingots. Oh, so knight armor. Oh, the steel armor and chest knight armor, which is this? This is the steel armor version, oh wow. Nice. I see. Then there's the plate armor. Which I suppose... No, that's iron. But which one is is better? You don't even need leather for this. This isn't even making any sense. We need iron blanks for plate armor. And it's the best armor you can get. And that doesn't require any leather. But for iron we need leather. Okay. I didn't realize that before, but that's how it is. I guess we don't need the skinning perk. Well, for the saddle, of course, but um, that can wait. Um, well, in that case, what could we make? We can't make knight steel armor, we could only make iron armor for now. Okay, and what does this sword require? Well, we're making iron blanks, period. Okay, it has gotten dark, but that's all right. Let's see. All right, yeah. We can craft a normal sword. How many blanks do we need for this? One. Just one. Alright. Let's pick ourselves... Oh yeah, yeah, well it's one for this size. Of course it's going to be bigger. Um, well, there's plenty of blades, but I want to go with the autism katana blade. Code blade. Um, let's pick ourselves a cross. Which suits it? That's for a two-hander, but... Yeah, let's go with this. Oh, this. Uh, let's go with this, yeah. Mm, handle type. Black or brown. Darker brown. Let's go with this one. It, it looks nice. Really nice. I suppose this is a mix of... of many sword types. So it looks a bit silly. Okay, let's go with the simple one. Can we can we increase the size? Yes, we can. <laughs> okay, we... We can't... Okay, the handle... Size does increase to a point. Now we need three iron blanks. We have that. Let's go with the maximum blade length. Okay. We have enough blanks. We have... It has 20 attack, 120 centimeters of blade length. Handle length is 40 centimeters. <laughs> That's quite long. Um, okay. Um, I just want to see some other options for this. This kind of look awesome also. Maybe we should go with one of these instead. Instead of the autism katana. 
Yeah, I think we should go with a more classical approach. Um, well, I suppose most of these still don't look like... Don't look like... Um, any real life... Oh, crap! I can't make this. Why? You can build a storage. Ah, crap. I see this. There's a limitation to what we can make. But to what point? The size can be a maximum of 63 since no <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> okay um, 63 centimeters and the handle size ah, what the heck okay it's... what what I'm sure I was able to make a an even long, longer blade. I would like to have a bastard sword. At the very least. Okay, we can make a bastard sword. But we can't make a two-hander. Of course, this gets slower. Okay, let's go. Could we make a 200 if we reduce the blade length? Oh, we can't. We can't do that. I see. Yeah. Well, bastard longsword it is. Okay, let's reduce this. And go to the maximum we can make. Yeah, this is what we are going to make. Just two iron blanks. Did we make it? Yeah, we did. Nice. It's actually worse than the original sword I had with me. And I can't even... Oh no, now I can equip it. Um, okay. What if I equip the... What? What is wrong with these stats? They keep changing. Now both of my swords are bastard swords. What? What the heck? The, what, what, what is this even? Okay. Um. Okay. Now I don't even know which is which. Oh. Uh, I don't understand this. It's too much for me. Uh, let's eat. A pumpkin. Now we'll go and get the fox meat. I don't have a clue which one is which. But I suppose since this one has this curved handle, it's my sword. Oh no, I'm not even wearing it. It appears, yeah. No, I'm wearing it. I am happy. I don't know. Uh, what could you teach me? That's just a sergeant. Grimmir. Grimmir has the sergeant skill. Okay. Um, it was possible to wear a torch and a sword at the same time. Ah, okay. This this can be held in the first hotkey. That's good to know. I'm still a bit confused about controls, but 
well, they are quite confu confusing. Okay, Mrs. Unknown Settler who's chopping air. What's your name? Your name is Eyjofur. You also have the butcher skill. Well, I'm glad the bandit that I killed wasn't the only one. Only one who had the butcher skill. Whose house? Arimundr. Hello, Arimundr. Could you teach me? Traveler. Hmm. That's also a skill I am going to need to learn. Guderrekrekrekrekr. Nice to meet you, swordsman. Something which I really need, but not right now. Gundrod. Scholar. Oh, okay, I have met you then. Alver. Well, Arvel, Alver isn't home. Um. Who's the owner of this? Ildi. Nice to meet you, Ildi. Could you teach me? Gardner. Um, I, <laughs> I want all of these skills. I, I also need the, the medicine skill. Hundi. What did Hundi teach? Novice blacksmithing. Oh. All right. Have I been here? Ulfinger? I think I have. That's the benchman. Benchman skill teacher. I think I have talked to Oliver also. Yeah, it was the butcher. Butcher skill. It's a blacksmith with the butcher skill. How odd indeed. Now I can hear people chopping wood everywhere, but but um I can't see anyone <laughs> Lake Yodfrodr I can't teach you anything oh that's too bad Um Maybe there's actually a shop like being built around here so Volodomiria. Wait, maybe... Maybe my vil village was vol Volodomiria. No, it wasn't. It, it's a question mark. So yeah, this is my village, but... But I suppose I should go to Volodomiria. Also. Just for a quick visit. Whose house? Kunmudr. Who isn't home? Where is Volodymyria? Over there. Just a quick visit there so that... Oh, there's another one. Come on, this is just awesome. Or was this the place where the bear was... ...making his sounds? I don't know. Now there's so many settlements, I, I can't keep even count of them, so... Okay, we're almost here. Soon we'll be able to see what, what is what. I just realized that maybe if we have an axe in our hand, we could help these people build their houses. Okay, I can't do it right now. I can't enter the building. But what if I had an axe? I had to look away because it's really random how my character might hit or punch. Okay, I, I, I don't see a, a way to help him. And now I have lost the... Okay, yeah, I have found it again, once again. Let's equip our sword. Yeah, it's the one we made. Well, supposedly, supposedly. 
Oh, come on, we must find someone with the trader skill. It's not so difficult. It shouldn't be so, so difficult, but... Mm, I think... There have... Or has... Have been... Some new houses have been finished and built. That's what I think I was going to say. Oh, crap. I, I don't even remember if I have visited all of these. I have visited this one. That, that I am sure of. This one is still being built and... The owner is Uffi. And Uffi is spending his or her time just walking into the wall. Maybe I need to be a friend of, of these people before I can help them build. So I would have to talk with them before. Before I can start helping. Okay, let's check the notice board once again. Right, we should probably have a city hall before before any tasks could appear. Mm. Not for sale. Is this my house? This could be my house. Let's wait till the sun's up. Yeah, this is my house. Finally. Let's put some of our stuff on here. Poor man. Well, we could keep the letter stuff. For now. Okay, more settlers. And a new settlement. That's awesome. There's a buffalo. Is it a set? Attacking? No. It's just clipping through the stones. Oh well, we found our own house, but... We have yet to find the trader. Alright. Hundi had blacksmithing. I keep talking to the same people, I don't even know if there's... There is any of... Any new people I could talk to. Ah, there are. Nice to meet you. Benchman. Did I just accidentally learn the skill? Don't tell me I did. Please no. Okay, I don't think I did. That's good. We can't... We can't build this house. Although I would like to. The progress would be quicker. Was this Olvar's house? This is Arngeir's house. Wait. What's her name, Arngeir? Ar 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 Arngeir? I don't... I don't know. Hey. Hello. That was the traveler. Still no traders. What's a shame. And neither do, we, neither do we have any shops in here. Oh well. Yeah, I think I'm just talking to the same people over and over again. I guess um, 
there could be some new people in the outskirts of the settlement. That could be a new person. Let's find out. Nah. He can't teach anything. And neither can this one. Yeah. I honestly don't know what to do. At least this person isn't inside the house. But that's a person we have talked to already. Well, since there's nothing else to do, we could build something ourselves. Let's make a two-level house. I don't want to live in one, but if we put it up for sale, maybe someone will live. It will make our quest easier. Yeah, let's build. Yeah. At least this way we are getting some experience and and making it more likely for for the shop to appear or someone with a skill for that. I have been talking about this for like two hours straight. Someone with the trading skill. Oh well, oh well. I guess we should or could look for for some more bandit sites or just visit the, the place where where we met the, what, the first bandit. Maybe maybe some other bandits have settled in nearby. This way we could increase our reputation. I don't know what the reputation thing is for. I guess I should read the update logs or whatever they are called. So that we could... Or I could understand. <laughs> yeah. Or maybe it's just just statistics for now. Nothing like to of anything use. I see someone on the left from me. With some luck, we it he, her, she, it might be um, someone new. Okay, almost built. This gives just five experience per per log, but that's just because um, I don't have too many points invested into the skill tree. If we actually invested more, then we would get more experience per per one um, wood spent. Because I think that's how it works. But yeah. Not enough wood. I thought we had one more, but that's not a problem. Hey, who are you? Egir. Talk to Egir. Yeah, we have talked to this one before. Nothing new. Alright. I haven't chopped wood in such a long while that I didn't even remember that this this was a thing. But at least it's easy to get some wood. Unlike it's unlike um, iron ores. They're not that easy and nice. But, um, yeah, you don't really get um, any experience towards, you, towards the skill you are 
um, using, but you only get the um, general or universal experience even from this stuff. Would be actually nice if there was a skill system where you. Unknown settler! Nice to meet you. Digger. Yeah, another perk which I could really use. But yeah, there are at least several new settlers. So eventually we'll find someone with a trading skill. Not for sale. For sale. I don't think we can actually get any gold from this, but... But um, at least we'll get someone to live there, I hope. Hundi. Okay, right, we have to find unknown settlers. That's the thing. That's what counts. Too bad the food items no longer heal you. Gunroder. And there we have something. Alright, I don't know. I think this. We've seen this place already. We're going to save and head for the question mark. I'm just a bit paranoid. This, this really isn't making sense. How can my other sword turn into the exact same sword as I made? And it was a better sword that I had. <laughs> so that's also a a bit odd. Mr. Burr. I don't think we want to face it in any case. Maybe we could take it down, but it's a bit a pain in the ass to gather these things for the healing. Okay, Mr. Burr. Just continue with your trip. I heard him. No, he is over there, but. The sounds are coming from the left side, but the bear is on the right side. So that's why I keep looking on the left side. I think I thought it would be over there. That's just another thing about this game. Oh, this is a new settlement. How nice. And they have some buff. Oh, no, that is not a settlement. That is a bandit lair. We're going to take a look anyways. We're going to talk to this one. Hello. Could you teach me? No, that's a butcher skill. We don't want that. Well, well, well. Okay, yeah, we got some friendship, but he's still not our friend. There's no block in this game. So this is the way you have to fight in order to not take no damage. This actually feels like a faster weapon than, than my first sword, so that's good. Nice! Rich man bottom, citizen top. And some other stuff. <laughs> good man. A bandit named Good Man. Good man. I think I saw another one. Wow, that's an awesome hat. But it's not animated. <laughs> Rich man. Now we need the steel armor. 
Oh, I'm so sad that there isn't a skin for this for this hat. It seemed like an awesome hat. But I can still hear sounds of building. So yeah, there there is another bandit. Yeah, if the bandits keep coming then then we won't have any problem with money. Hmm this one looks to be wearing some leather stuff. Or is that iron? Hello nice to meet you. Apron <laughs> Apron Risk Taker Oh That's the illegal skill. Someday, someday I shall, shall learn that skill. I think I'm going to let you build your house. I don't want to destroy all the bandit lairs. Well, not yet at least, because they are so quite rare at, at the moment. So let's just let let's let them expand a bit, and after that we can we can attack them. Maybe there will be a challenge at least. If several bandits could gang up on me or my. Um, well, let's say Warband, I don't know. Um, what should we call it? Having several people with you, fighting with you. For you. Okay, we don't need any more tomatoes. There's plenty of food. Food isn't a problem in this game anymore. But the health management is. Blocking skill would be a nice addition, though. But, um,. When fighting with the bandits, there's actually the sound of blocking, but I don't know if it's just because the swords hit each other. And that's what makes the sound. Okay, let's check out this cave and that's going to be for this video, I think. Next time we shall find the trader. That seems like the ultimate quest or task for me. <laughs> I'm talking so slowly. Um, right, there's some iron. Wow. We don't necessarily even need iron anymore. Well, for the moment, but um, we will have to make the steel stuff in any case, and I really want a two-handed sword. So that's something to um, wait, to wait for. Nice, nice one. I wonder if this is just an iron cave or this one also has a treasure chest. I don't mind not finding a treasure chest in this one. If that's going to be the case, but this is quite a big cave. Relatively big, but it doesn't seem like one with, with treasures. But it has plenty of iron, and iron we do need. Um, how much? We have over 1000 gold. We could actually now take some other perk besides Trader. Like the Digger perk, for example, it makes digging so much easier. Digging for iron. I don't think I can even make um, stone houses yet, so so that wouldn't be much of use. 
Okay, this one didn't have any treasures, but it have had plenty of um, plenty of uh, iron. Would be cool if there was something else besides iron and steel, but I guess this is a bit more realistic. Yeah, realistic. Just like the mushrooms. Um, all right. Well, I suppose uh, this is it for now. Um, I'm going to continue my adventures in kingdoms every day. So I will be posting these videos every day. Uh, I will be posting them quite raw, so please forgive me for that, but that's the way it goes. There's not that much time for editing. Alright, well. Oh!